I actually ran out of gel for this hair, Mr. Derek. So I will be invoicing you for a gel. I will pay you a lifetime supply of gel if you continue to give me that fierce Elvis style. I literally don't even know how it stays up. Like, it doesn't even move. <laughs> Happy Fashion Month! I'm Derek Blasberg. I'm the head of fashion and beauty here at YouTube. The shows are coming through, and while it's still not safe to travel and we're staying home to stay safe, I thought I'd ask an expert in the field of YouTubery how to watch the shows, none other than the baddest I know. Here you. Sorry, hold on. Hashtag fashion week. Hey, Bretman Rock. Hi, Mr. Derek. Oh my gosh, I feel like I see you more than my friends these days. And that, that's a good that's thing. That's a good thing. Uh, Bretman, do you remember the first time that we met? Fashion week 2019, I think. It was definitely a fall fashion week because I was cold as hell. <laughs> Cheers. Chen Chen. He only called me bitch because he doesn't know my name. Miss Jared. Oh! Fashion month looks a little bit different now. I thought you could provide people with a bunch of tips on how to watch the shows from home. What do you say? I feel like you would know more about it though than me. I mean, I've obviously gone to more fashion shows than you because I'm old enough to be your grandma. In fashion but... terms, you're vintage. <laughs> <laughs> but I would venture to say that you are the pro on consuming video content at home. I am very much happy to pass on some knowledge to you if you're willing to pass the knowledge to me. It's a deal. So I guess the first thing, street style is out, but screen style is in. Was street style ever in anyways? When you were really young. Like, you were just a baby. What is um, screen style to you, Mr. Derek? Well, I guess in the fashion world, for several years, you saw a lot of editors and models and all these people celebrated for their off-duty fashion looks. Now all we can do is take it to the screens. We want to give fierce, zoom, screen style, couture. This week is the time to do it. I love that. When you said screen style to me, I felt like I'm just dressing up <laughs> for the specific screen. I look like I'm like all dressed up right now, but really if I pull the screen down, I'm in my undies, you know? So like outside of the frame? Yeah, from the chest happening. up, chest up fashion. <laughs> this is a crop top. <laughs> Hashtag screen style. Another important tip, even if it's virtual, always dress up for fashion week. Period. Dress up and honestly, sometimes you have to beat the face too. Whatever I'm doing, I'm getting my mail, I'm dressed up in heels. If I'm cooking <laughs> eggs, I'm dressed up in an ensemble. You know what I mean? Yeah. Why is it not cooking? Oh, I didn't turn it on. She ain't got no gas. Wait, why do I not gas? Hey, 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 hey. My stick is very vital. Uh, 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 uh. To rock the house. Uh, 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 go. It's time to rock the house. To rock the house. It's tricky. It's tricky, 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 tricky. Ooh, look how good your hair looks when you give me a profile. Inspired by Mr. Elvis. As you can see, I saw this pink Stella McCartney suit and I was like, Elvis would definitely wear that with this hair. And <laughs> that's exactly what I did. And I got this like freshwater pearl. I've never owned like a real pearl until this one that my manager got me. I feel like they just shine differently, you know? It's very Kamala Harris, a pearl necklace. Yes. I'm giving you very much inauguration. What is the B for on your necklace? Is that for Blasper? It's actually for baddest bleep. One time I remember you told me you don't love being surrounded by people. So are you just thriving with this digital fashion week situation? I honestly think it was made for me. <laughs> they did it for me and I'm just so glad. Not that I hate people, I just, ugh. Just like the anxiety of like having to socialize with people and it's just like, it. See, even my cat agrees. I'm kind of like socially awkward. I really am one of those people that I, I don't speak unless I'm spoken to, you know? Well, that's a definite tip. Not all of your friends have to be fashion people. Exactly. I'm here for fashion. I'm not here to make friends. <laughs> <laughs> but aren't you surrounded by friends at your house? You've got cats. You've got I have plants, four cats, a dog, and one neighbor. I have everything I need. All right, ladies, y'all better have your cute outfits ready. 
Are you guys ready for your front row seats of Fashion Week? All right, ladies, y'all gotta drink some water. I'm giving you very much hydrated. My girls are giving you looks today. You better serve these looks. Wait, hold on, I'm not, I'm just watering that one for real. <laughs> What's the next tip? On oh, number four. We, we are so quick. Honestly. What's that? Oh, I just spilled some coffee on me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's the good news about watching shows from home. People don't even notice you have a little bit of coffee on your crotch. And that's why we love screen fashion, because you can't see it if it's not on screen. But don't you like going to Fashion Week from bed? And couches, or the floor. <laughs> or the pole. She's right there. <laughs> Speaking of. Our next tip, and of course you know this, Bretman. You can see all the shows by logging on to youtube.com slash fashion. And if you go right now, you can actually set reminders so you're alerted when all of your favorite fashion designers debut their collections. Period. YouTube.com slash fashion. You can't miss it. Another hot tip, don't forget to participate in the live chat. Period. You can discuss all of your favorite looks, favorite models, favorite shoes, favorite purse, favorite handbag, favorite accessories, favorite rings, favorite face paint. What else you got? Even if you like the music. I honestly love the fashion runway music. They be playing bangers sometimes. Do you ever participate? No, I'm so scared. Oh. Some people well, are just found... so rude. <laughs> I have found that during the fashion shows, it's mainly like real fashion fans that are, oh, I think this show is inspired by the Richard Avedon picture of Dovima with the elephants from Paris in the 1950s. But yes, to your point, I do think there can be some shade thrown in live chats, but not during fashion week. None of that. You know, like when you and I went to that Brandon Maxwell show and Bella Hadid winked at you? Yes, definitely. The most iconic moment of my life, honestly. So my favorite thing about the live chat, all the things I would have said to you when we were sitting next to each other at that show, I now just put it in the live chat. Such as, work, queen, slay, fierce. I, I would have probably spammed that live chat with just, <laughs> all caps. Something just happened. I clicked on the movie recording. It's recording, but my face is frozen. Should I, okay, oh gosh, I think I accidentally stopped it. Okay, I think we're good. She's recording. As you know, Bretman, it is most important to know the vocabulary. So I'm gonna tell you some fashion vocabulary and you tell me what you think these words mean. And I don't have to spell it or anything, right? You don't have to spell it, just tell me what you think these words are. Okay, 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 okay. Spelling is not my forte. What do you think a balaclava is? Balaclava? Oh um, my gosh, is that a, a hat? Ding, 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 yes! Hat? A balaclava is a knitted head covering that shows only the face or part of the face. What is a bustle? Oh my gosh, I know this because it was trending on TikTok. It was trending because of Vogue. Uh, it made their butts look big. It's like a Victorian Victorian kind of style of skirt. It's a Victorian booty. You are yes. right. That okay. is not the exact oh definition. God. A bustle is a general term we use to describe the filling in the back of a skirt to give a rounder posterior. Vogue's Hamish Bowles did a TikTok video, which we're going to show right here. Right now. Today I'm going to show you how to wear a bustle. First off, you need a pillow. <laughs> Just like that, you've got yourself a 2020 version of a 19th century walking dress. What is an espadrille? Oh my god, this was on RuPaul's Drag Race with Shea Coulee. What was Shea Coulee wearing when she was wearing an espadrille? Was it heels? Yes, an espadrille is a strappy sandal. Oh my Specifically, god! Specifically, an espadrille is a canvas shoe with a rope sole. What is a gusset? A gusset? A gusset. Is this a person, place, or thing? <laughs> it's a thing, but it's a specific part of an article of clothing. Can I have the spelling, please? G-U-S-S-E-T. Oh, I feel like it's in a woman's clothing for some reason. Where? In what part of the body? Oh, a part of the body. Uh, maybe... No. Not in here, right? No, I'm gonna give it to you. A gusset is a small piece of fabric typically sewn in the shape of a diamond in the armpits and the crotch. Is it just for irritation? <laughs> what they're supposed to do is provide a little extra stretch in parts of mobility. 
Oh, okay, I okay, that's good to know. These are practical terms. Now, when you go into the comment section on your next fashion show, you can be like, you better work that gusset, honey. Yes, I love the gusset on this. I need the gusset <laughs> in every color. Next and I have word. this top with just the gusset. <laughs> what is the leg of mutton? What? A leg of mutton. A leg of mutton? This is so fashion. It sounds like a dish. I'm gonna give it to you. It's a sleeve that is cut with a very full top that's gathered or pleated into the armhole then tapers gradually to fit closely at the wrist. A leg of mutton sleeve. Oh my gosh. How does that look like? Fat Sheva does a lot of leg of mutton sleeves. Saint Laurent has done a lot of leg of muffins. Chanel has done a lot of leg of muffins. Oh, uh, okay, very Victorian. It's like a peasant. Like Miss Queen Elizabeth. Boom! She loved a leg of mutton. Macrame. Ooh, I know this one. Macrame is like, it's like knots, right? It's like, it's like a technique of like weaving. Cause I make- Bravo. Oh, you've got this one, Bretman. Macrame is a hand technique for making small pieces of fabric and trimmings by knotting two to four or more yarn, strings, or cords into a variety of decorative patterns. Macrame. What is a peplum? I know a peplum dress, a peplum top, but what does a peplum mean? Isn't it when it kind of like curves up right above your waist area? It's like this. Ding, 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 ding. You got it. You yes. Oh my God. You were looking at me like I, I was so off. A peplum is the small ruffle or flared section in the construction of a jacket or a blouse that extends a short distance below the waistline. Wow, my brain is working today. I don't know why. Maybe it's that hair. Yeah. <laughs> Extra IQ. You got more right than you got wrong, so you've passed our fashion vocabulary quiz. Another tip, don't forget to take care of your mind. How do you stay mentally fit, Bretman? Meditate, guys. Meditate. You have to mentally prepare yourself for some of these looks that these fashion girls are serving this year. Honestly, going to fashion weeks and going to fashion shows is very mentally draining. I just remind myself that I'm cuter than most of the models, even though I'm not. You know what I mean? Because sometimes I go to these fashion um, shows and I'm just like, wow, I am ugly. You're not ugly. You give full glamour. Before I go in there, I'm just like, okay, wait, 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 wait. You're prettier than half of these models. Model, model. Don't let these bitches get into your head. I'm cute. I'm cute. So yeah. So you meditate, you give yourself mental pep talks. I journal. I don't even know how to write, but I journal. I hope we see a picture of your journal and it's just like stick figures. <laughs> it's just a date. <laughs> <laughs> Bretman, I know that we're all watching the shows from home this season, but I think it's important to remember to always stay active, don't you? Yes, and I already have that covered. I don't even need to have a fashion week. I've seen your content. I've seen your fitness content. You know what they say, if you stay fit, you don't gotta get fit. If you stay chic, you ain't gotta get chic. Period. Wow. And our last tip, as you know, Bretman, Stay hydrated. And stay healthy. Here. Because health is the new wealth. It really is. Safe is the new chic. <laughs> Mr. Derek, you got vaccinated. jokes today. You really got jokes today. <laughs> Please stay um, hydrated because a lot of these male models got me all thirsty sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> and Miss Derek said, y'all gotta keep healthy and drink water. Hashtag, do fishes drink water? Or the water drinks the fish? I don't know what I'm saying. We, that, do, do fishes drink? Bretman, these tips were incredible. Thank you for joining me today. Everybody, please like this video. Leave a comment below of any digital fashion week tips you may have to share with us. Don't forget to subscribe for more hot and feisty fashion content like you've got today. Stay safe, stay chic. What else should we say? And stay hydrated. <laughs> Period. 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 Per. Period. Fashion. 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 <laughs>